how should you use your first buy? Basically, use your first buy to just get comfortable with the process of buying. And also just so that you can pay attention to what is happening to that particular stock. So you can get used to, I suppose, the volatility. You can start seeing the movements of that coin. Now, if I had got it at 689, it's currently on the rise. It's doing actually quite well. All right. So just get used to that. Get a feel for the volatility, whether it's down or up, so that you can get comfortable with the process and so that you don't get scared off by the process. OK, because I can imagine as a first timer coming to Poloniex that your first trade can make or break you. So if you were to make your first trade, let's say you're using the um, criteria I'm giving you now, which is quite a few zeros, experiencing a bit of a flat line and also, you know, not doing necessarily too well. Because at the time when I chose it, Digibyte was down here in the kind of one to two percent gain. OK, that's what you need to choose. Now, if it does well, you will gain confidence. You will think, yes, I've picked a currency. My criteria is pretty good. OK, so that could make you quite confident. On the flip side, if it went down into the minuses and suddenly started losing money, you might think, oh, God, I've got to sell it now. So use it as a learning point because selling it now is not necessarily a good thing, OK, because you'd make a loss. If you suddenly experienced a decline in the value, then you may think to yourself, oh, God, I've got to get rid of it before I make a bigger loss. No, stick with it and see it through. Sometimes that makes you more resilient than making a gain because then you'll think I'm Superman. I'm going to every time I'm going to go on a crypto coin it's going to do really well. And then if it does badly, you get disappointed and angry. OK, so get used to it not doing so well and seeing it rise over 24 hours as that will give you more resilience when it comes to being in this game for the long term. You've got to get used to the lows because they do happen. You do get frustrated. You do think to yourself, damn it, I bought it at the wrong time. It will get you used to the process. It will get you more instinctive about your trades because you'll think to yourself, right, I know at what point I want to enter the trade in. I know what point I want to buy at. So have a look at the coin, see how it's performing. Then you make the buy. Uh, when it gets down to the price, you're happy to buy it at. And then you can just see how it performs over time.